events have become rampant due to overloading and poor weather. The fertilities are often high due to a shortage of life jackets, latest 30 lives having been lost due to the same cause. The National Economic Empowerment Dialogue Party spokesperson Moses Matovo urged the National Meteorological Center to release a weather forecast and early warnings on weather changes for navigators. National Meteorological Center mandated to tell Ugandans the environmental changes, climate changes, but I think they have not done their part. Because during August, July, August, we normally experience bad weathers on the lakes. But our people, all those people using the lake, most of them, I think, they are not aware. So I think the time is now for these people to come up and do what we call early warnings. For people to know which areas are bad, if they are going to transact on the lake, which times should they move? Is it at night? Is it day? Let them reduce the taxes on life jackets such that all people can afford them. All people using the lake can at least afford these life jackets. However, the opposition wants the Electoral Commission to revise and implement the electoral reforms before proceeding with the electoral roadmap for 2026 general elections. To appeal to the Electoral Commission, number one, if they thought elections are part of the pillars of democracy, let as a country first pay attention to the electoral reforms. And therefore, all of us, including electoral commission, would be piling pressure to parliament, to government, or to all those stakeholders that can generate electoral reforms. That's one. Number two, electoral commission is launching a roadmap, and in its own statement, is simply is anticipating demarcations of new elect electoral areas. Now, how can an organization be organizing for an electoral exercise, an electoral process, when you don't know how many other units are going to be created? So how are you budgeting? How are you planning? How are you going to recruit? How are you going to cut out the process? Jimmy Akan